Go inside the imagination of Chirp. Explore the unknown. Turn on the super hyper speed fires. And even learn something new. Penguins live in the Antarctic. <laughs> Chirp on Cubo. to Willa, but I can't right now. You know, I have to finish all this work by tonight. <laughs> what the? inside working. special holiday just for my dad. Willa's dad's day? It's even got a catchy name. He should do all the dad stuff he likes to do, like have breakfast in bed and relax in his hammock with the paper. Oh, oh, and I'm gonna make sure he gets to play his favorite game, golf. Oh. Oops, sorry, Dooley. Yeah. <laughs> oh. oh. <laughs> Get a holiday, huh? Yes, Officer Willis Walrus reporting for Willis Dad's Day. Huh? Wake up, everybody! We need to get breakfast started. <laughs> Giving your dad his own special day. What a nice idea! Dad like to drink coffee in the morning, Willa? <gasps> coffee! Coming right up! That doesn't look quite right. I don't get it either. Definitely a grown-up thing. I'll make a fresh squeezed orange juice, too! Here you go, Gladys. Thanks, Inky. But my name's Willa. If you say so! Now all I need is the juicer. Hey, thanks! <laughs> that worked great! Time to make eggs! Here they are, Willa! <laughs> it's okay, Coco. That's why eggs come in dozens, so there's extra. Uh, 
Huh? <laughs> Happy Willow's Dad's Day, Dad! Oh, uh, thanks. What? Because you work so hard all the time, I made up a holiday just for you. You get to do your favorite things all day, starting with breakfast in bed. Everybody likes that. Oh, sure. Wow, isn't that nice. Mmm, mm. chewy. Thank you so much, Willa. Wasn't just me, my animal pals helped too. <laughs> when you finish breakfast, you get to relax in your hammock. I'll be right back. Come on, Gus. It's my dad's holiday day. Give me his newspaper. Whoa! When I wasn't finished eating the sports section. <laughs> Here you go, Dad. Happy reading. Why, thank you, Willa. It's so, um, well, uh, festive looking. Whee! <laughs> <laughs> now you just lie there and relax. <clears throat> Hey, why don't you make up a Happy Willis Dad's Day song? A what? But I've only had three lessons, Willa. That's a lot. Uh. Okay, time to start cleaning up. Ew. Uh. This is more work than I thought. Need help cleaning up, Gladys? Thanks, guys. Would you mind washing the dishes? And it's Willa, remember? Right! right. Why just the dishes? Yeah, let's really help old Gladys out and clean everything. Hooray! <laughs> I think this idea is going to work great. And all the dishes at once, Rinsorama! Okay, ready? I'll tell you, that's a real showstopper, Duels. So, you know, maybe you could stop the show right there. Really? Thanks, sir. Huh? <gasps> but, um, the show's not quite over. So whatever you do, keep looking at the seals. Hit it, guys. <laughs> things for the holes. Ah. Thank you. Oh, thank you very much. Very nice. Hey, wait, sir. Um, would you like to see me tap dance? Um, thanks anyway, duels, but you know, I'm kind of entertained out right now. What's going on around here? Willa? Dad's going to love this. Willa? Willa! 
It's your own 37-hole golf course. <laughs> Isn't it great, Dad? <clears throat> Willa, do you have any idea what a gigantic mess you've made? Oh, <laughs> yeah. I guess it is a little wet and muddy and stuff. I know you meant well, honey, but... Dad, it's just that I know how hard you work and I wanted to give you a special day. Hey, Willa, I made up a tune for your song. Listen. Happy Willa's Dad's Day, the kind of day when dads play. You may have had a bad day, but now it's time for fun. <laughs> Today's a holiday when I spend time with you. Really? Thanks, Dad. And we're going to be spending a lot of time together cleaning up. <laughs> Blinky and Bob are tied as they approach the 37th hole. Tough break for the Blinkster. What are you talking about? It's a hole in one. How do you figure that? Told ya! Something dreadful has happened to the prince. There is only one detective mm. to solve the case. In the land of Once Upon a Time. Sandra Ochia Parody, fairy tale detective. That hypnotized green thing is my assistant, Bo. Cinderella, I have a plan. We must all stand our ground. You're not gonna get away with this. Case solved. Sandra, the fairy tale detective, here on Cubo. Yes, in a, my arm's about to fall off kind of way. Your kangaroo never misses, Willa. He's right, Coco. <laughs> You're like a professional jumper. Time to give somebody else a turn. Like Sarah, Kara, and Lara. Hi, girls. One rope, no waiting. No thanks, Wanda. We'd mess up our cool new dues. Held in place by our brand new super scrunchies. <laughs> My name happens to be Willa, and I thought... <gasps> hey! Wow. Flashing lights, music, it's like a party on your head. Our scrunchies are horrific. <laughs> Think they make them the kangaroo tips? <laughs> Whoa! Willa! A little help. Whoa! Ugh. Willa! Somebody! Hello! <laughs> Hi, Dad. Sorry, Dad. How was your day? That's nice. Come on, let's go buy me a super scrunchie before they're all gone. Easy does it, Willa. Honey, didn't you just have a birthday, you know, and you got lots of nice clothes and stuff then? Yes, but that was nearly three weeks ago. Styles changed, Dad. Thanks, Gladys. What about using your allowance, Willa? Um, I sort of spent that already. Sorry, pumpkin. I think now you're going to have to wait till next week's allowance. A whole week? All the scrunchies will be gone. I'll be scrunchy-less. Well, let's see. Oh, I know. You could earn the money to buy one. You know, doing you know, household chores. Great. I'll get started right now. Um, thanks, Willa. But, you know, I think the old vacuum here is going to need some fixing now, so, well, maybe you could find another chore to do. <gasps> How did he... Uh, 
heard you got the no scrunchy blues, sweetie. Uh-huh. I've got to think of another chore I can do to earn money, Jenny. Hmm. Looks like the grass could use a trim. That seems like a Willa-sized job. You're right, Jenny. That scrunchie's gonna be mine as soon as I mow this lawn. Is hard work. Pardonnez moi, you've crunched my croquet wicket. Oh, sorry, Samuel. Uh, trying to earn some scratchy money. Uh. Surely you can find someone else to do such a lowly job. Uh, how about you? Please. A creature of my breeding would never think of working for... All the grass you can eat? Deal. Oh, we did it. We mowed the whole yard. And I have a humpful of dandelions to prove it. <laughs> oh, pardon. Willa! Well, ooh, looks like you put a lot of hard work in here, Willa. <clears throat> May not be perfect, but I think you earned this. Wow, my first paycheck. Oh, thanks, Dad. And look, while I was mowing, I found the garden hose. Ah, so you did. Oops, don't worry. I'll buy you a new hose. Can I mow the lawn again? Oh, please, no. I mean, you know, it'll take at least a week for the grass to go back, honey. I, I better patch this up. Super scrunchy and a new hose. I have to find another job. Um, maybe you could help your dad water the flowers? Whoa! I think he's already watering them, Tiny. And the neighbor's flowers, too, Lou. The neighbor's! That's it! Great idea! Taking your bunnies for a ride, Willa? They're not just bunnies anymore. We're Willa's All Natural Gardening Service. We're gonna trim all the neighbors' yards and earn a bunch of money. And the neighbors agreed to this? Well, not yet, but they will when they see what a great job my bunnies do. Oh, okay. Wait a minute. For what? Well, what's it look like? Oh, it looks like my mom's flowers and my dad's vegetable garden are gone. Willa! Oops. <laughs> Guess we over mowed your yard. But we won't charge you extra. I don't think my parents are going to pay anything for this. Hmm. I guess you're right. I better replant everything, huh? And I will. Just as soon as I think of another way to make enough money to pay for all the seeds and flowers and stuff. Bye, Dooley! Oh, too many bunnies, huh, Willa? I got just the answer. <laughs> no thanks, Gus. I don't need less bunnies, but I do need more money. Yeah, your bunnies are too dirty to eat anyway. Hmm. Maybe I should have my elephants give all you bunnies a shower. <gasps> That's it! Grand opening! Willa's Car Wash! Come one, come all! Get your car washed by two pachyderms! Good job, Tiny and Lou. Oh, thanks, Willa. <laughs> well, this is a sudden career change. What happened to your all-natural gardening business, sweetie? This plant is much better. People have dirty cars. I have elephants. Bingo! Playing in the sprinklers and getting paid for it? This is the best job ever! <gasps> Oopsie! I was trying to reach that dirty spot on the roof. <laughs> I'm so clumsy! Now, now. We'll get it fixed, Tiny. We'll just have to wash a lot more. Cars. All I wanted was a super scrunchie. But now I need to earn enough money to fix half the neighborhood. 
We have some ice cubes if that'll do any good, Gladys. No thanks, guys. And my name's Willa. If you say so. Well, you may not have much money, Willa, but you sure do have a lot of friends. Yeah. Hey, Gladys. Hmm. Well, first, I think I need someone to keep an eye on my big plans to make sure they don't turn into big messes. Jenny? You got it. sure what we're doing, but I think we're almost done. Um, my name's Willa, but thanks, guys. Huh, pool cleaning's a lot of work. Oh, yeah? Well, try being a pool toy. <laughs> thanks, everyone. We make a great team. And we made a lot of this. <laughs> It's not food, it's money, bunnies. People use it for things like buying a new garden hose, fixing a messed up yard, and a dented car. And best of all, I've got enough leftover to buy the super scrunchy ever. Right. Yeah. You know, I'm very proud of you, Willa, working to spend your money on that hair thingamabob all by yourself. Well, I didn't do it all by myself. Now you can buy what you really, really want. Feels good, doesn't it? I guess so. I mean, I want that scrunchie. I really want it. But what if there's something else I really, really want? Uh, like what? Here you go, Inky, Blinky, and Bob. Thanks, Gladys. She is the nicest gopher I've ever met. This chocolate pizza isn't half bad, either. Bob! I can't believe you drank the whole thing. Yeah, what were you thinking? How about a root beer float, Gus? Oh, no pork chop flavored ice cream again. This thank you party was a lovely idea, Willa. But are you sure you don't mind giving up that super scrunchie? I'm sure. I've got a scrunchie that's super duper. And I made it myself. <laughs> <laughs> Kinda hard not to. New super scrunchies? Aren't they the Kanga cutest? I still can't believe Sarah, Kara, and Lara just got bored with them and threw them out. So, last week, 